I know you're gonna dig this. I don't understand what's going on. Oh, hello guys. This is what happened, but you weren't here, so you missed it. It is December 27th, and you know what that means. It's one of our wedding anniversaries. <laughs> we have two. We have the 27th and the 28th. If you're new to the vlogs, we got married um, long time. a long time, 32 years ago on the 28th of December. And then when we had the religious ceremony, when I turned 21, that was three years later, I guess. And that we couldn't get the same date for the church because it was booked or something and we had to do the day before. So that's why we have two different uh, yes. wedding anniversaries. We got married the week after, uh, what's her name, Vanessa Williams. Vanessa Williams! Same church, oh, all the flowers are still there, so it that, was that helped. It was beautiful, wasn't it? Life-size nativity set. Yeah, thanks Vanessa. In church, yeah, it was so... Well, she didn't have anything to do with the nativity set, but she was pregnant and so was I. <laughs> I think we were only a couple months apart, so... So we were going to go hiking today, guys, but it's not a nice day. And we got kind of a late start, but now it seems like the sun is coming out just the tiniest bit, so I'm kind of regretting that we didn't go hiking, but no regrets 2016, right? Right. But it's not 2016 yet. Better get some rain gear. Rain gear? Why? Oh, you want to go hiking in the rain? That I'm sounds saying, pretty if you miserable. Get caught out there, you won't have something with you, right? Oh, well, how about a garbage bag? That would be better than nothing. Okay. So, change of plans. We've decided to do our returns today. So we're going to run out to Target, I think, and Marshalls. And we're in Chester. Hey, everybody. Not the town of Chester, the car of Chester, right? Yes. This is Maddie's ride. So, um, it's really nice. This car took me to get my tat yesterday, too. Isn't that funny? <laughs> it was, it's it's kind of neat. It reminds me of a London taxi a little bit. A black, a black cab. Not me. Really? A, a black cab and the villain's mobile from 101 Dalmatians. It's much bigger, though. Not the box truck one, the one that the, the one that they had together, Horace and uh, what's his face. I think it does. Let me know what you think it reminds you of in the comments. Mark says it's known as the toaster. Yeah. Because it looks like a little boxy toaster. Hope we don't pop out. All right, we're in Target. Any book recommendations? Well, this caught my eye. Oh, welcome to Night Vale. Yes. Do you guys listen to this podcast? Do you? I've seen, well, seen, heard a little bit here and there. It's like really good. Really? What's it about? Oh, it's like really weird. <laughs> well, then it must be really good. <laughs> Is this the next uh, Fifty Shades one? I think that's the one that's like um, from the guy's point of view. And it's um, like. Okay. Oh, this looks like a um, dragon tattoo one. I thought he was dead. <laughs> I thought the author was dead. This guy is the new author continuing. Oh, somebody it. took it over. Yeah. Interesting. Right? Yeah. Did you like that series of books? I did and I didn't. I found it a little bit hard to follow after the first few. Um, I don't know if it was just because like, there were a lot of really complicated names that were like similar. <laughs> I don't know. It was just like... I hate when that happens. I don't know. <gasps> what? All 194 episodes of I Love Lucy. What? Look at that. What? Now that's hot. Wow, that's a big box. One through five, six through nine. Light a beat of Vizman. We just watched that one colorized on uh, Christmas. You know what this reminds nice. me of? What? Remember that um, book that we would listen to, the audiobook? Mm hmm. With uh, Stephen Colbert. And Jerry Andy Blank, Sparis. yeah, <laughs> and uh, oh, what was that called? Oh, I can't remember this now. This has a very similar feel. Oh, does it? Yeah, about that like creepy town. Uh huh. I think I kind of want this. Oh, I have a gift card. 
<laughs> we know. Oh my god, I'm exhausted. <laughs> Marshall's was a little crazy. It's kind of busy, but we returned. Um, I got Mark a dashboard cam, but it didn't work right, and we were overcharged. So we got the money back for that. So that means you get to treat yourself to something. Do I? Yes, you do. Something on Amazon, probably, I'm thinking. Because you told me you wanted to get that knife. Which one? <laughs> the one with the wood handle. Oh, the open handle? Yeah. Yeah, it wasn't cheap. It was like 12 13, Well, 14. that's something. Eh, I don't really need it. <laughs> Do you really need half the stuff that you like and collect? No. No, so, but it's nice to collect. Maybe we should focus on things we need in 2016. Um, like, yes, but... this car that we needed. Yes, but... I want you to treat yourself as well because that was a Christmas present. All right, so we're gonna run into uh, Michael's to pick up some art supplies. Possibly. Possibly. Maddie wants to get some coloring supplies. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey, it's a stress reliever. You should color too. Why honey. are you scoffing? Yeah. Don't be scoffing. Don't scoff. Hello. So we got home from the store a little while ago. We had some snack. We watched a little Harry Potter musical. <laughs> Are you loving it? Yeah. So we just wanted to show you what we got at Target. We didn't really get anything at Michael's or Marshall's. Beautiful. But, oh, I love these dish towels from Target. They're marked down half price. You know, you guys know I love dish towels. I have a huge collection. I have these in reserve. And that whole jack-o'-lantern uh, thing is full of fresh dish towels just waiting to be used. Because I go through a lot of dish towels. Use me, use me. Yeah, because I cook all day. So these were only $3 for these two super cushy, ready, thirsty to be, you know, sucking up that water. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Christmas crackers, crackers. We're going to use these on New Year's Eve. Yeah, Wonderful. there's there's ten in there. That means we each get two. Wow. I know, right? That's gonna be fun. Well, I want the little Scotty dog. <laughs> okay. Those were only five doll hairs, hence the five doll hair sticker. I had a gift card and I picked up some books. Ah! <laughs> I have been wanting this book for like over a year. I love F. Scott Fitzgerald. This is about um, Zelda. Mm -hmm. This is fiction though. It's fiction. But it's based on Zelda. It's not a novel by Zelda? No. It's by Therese and Valve. Oh, okay. But good it's supposed good to be deal. really good, so I'm excited. Yeah. And then I just saw this for the first time in stores. I don't know if it just came out or what, but um Welcome to Wait, Nightmare. did I already talk about this? I think so, yes. Okay. But you got it. You heard. So I got it. Yes. And Daddy got his we exchanged his shirt that we got him on Christmas. We got him his oatmeal colored. I where did he even put it? Mm -hmm. Um looks like a it's made out of a moving blanket. <laughs> you know that quilty fabric that they wrap around your furniture when you hire a moving company? Maddie and I got oatmeal color because we thought that that was really classy and fresh and everything. And he was like, you know what? I'm not really into this color. So we exchanged it today and we got a green one. Oh, here it is. Duh. All right. Sorry about the darkness there. I wanted, oh, we didn't get green. I'm sorry. They didn't have the green in extra large, so we got this beautiful blue color. So, that should be very nice on him. I love it. And we got an S-ton of cat food because they're really loving the Dick Van Patten uh, limited ingredient cat food, the natural balance. I have a whole bag of it. Yes, it is the Dick Van Patten. That's right, Vince from uh, Beverly Hills Housewives, Eileen's husband. His dad made uh, cat food and dog food. So there you go. And now for my next trick, <laughs> I'm going to be making my first creation from the Instant Pot. And I'm gonna be making, where is it? Red lentil chili. So that's what that looks like. And it's got quite a few ingredients in there. So I hope it's good. We're going to have that on some rice and uh, 
I'll check back with you guys and let you see how it goes. Oh my gosh, I feel like the luckiest girl in the world right now. I'm getting serenaded by some ukulele in the background. Some real door whore stuff. <laughs> Maddie's working on some doors. And I'm gonna about to fire up the Instant Pot right here. I have my ingredients in here for the lentil stew. A couple of additions of my own. You guys know I never follow the recipe. So I got that all in there. I got to add the tomato, garlic, and pepper part to that. And it only has to cook on pressure for like 10 minutes. So it's going to be quick and easy and hopefully delicious. So let me get this all together so we can pop that baby open like an R2-D2 pressure pot and <laughs> eat from its goodness inside. All right, Shawnee, what does the Hanley handbell say? Go ahead. <laughs> Ring it. Where is it? Where is the bell? Are you kidding me? It's right there. <laughs> Sean. Oh boy. Yeah. What? And now what do you yell? Yeah. Da -da. Da -da. Nice. So here is the beautiful red lentil chili slash stew. I added some carrots to it because Mark asked me to. So this looks pretty amazing. It smells really good too. And of course some perfectly cooked uh, basmati rice. What do you think about that sir? It's pretty good. We're gonna plate it up and we will be back for the tasty tasting. Alright, let's plate it up. And yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah? Did you try it yet? No. It's really hot. Yes. Make sure you blow on that like a freaking tornado. Make a dragon. <laughs> <laughs> that was all wrong. Blow on it, blow on it, blow on it, blow on it, blow on it. Mm. Yeah? Good. Excellent. Well, I hope you enjoy. Enjoy that red lentil chili. Thanks. I love the way you drop it down. <laughs> Come on and back, back, back it up. Papi Chula. <laughs> All right, so this made a lot of stuff. I have not one there. I'm going to have another one. That is here. crazy. It was crazy and we good, ate a lot though. Of it, too. it was crazy good. It was very good. This is nice. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I glad you it. like it. Do I have chocolate all over my face? No. <sighs> Exhausted. But anywho. So what'd you think of the first, the Very Potter musical? I thought it was very awesome. Well get ready because the second one's even funnier. <laughs> I give it a... <sighs> <laughs> it's super mega foxy awesome hot. Oh, I just have to say thank you to Hanley. I just saw the um, animated Christmas card you sent us on uh, the email. It's really good. I didn't get to see it yet, but I am going to watch it. It's a good thing Hanley does that for a living because like, he's, he's really, really good, good at, at it. it. That's cool. <laughs> so, <laughs> we're going to wrap it tonight. It's, what, it's 10 o'clock. How about 10 that? It is 10, 10, 10 o'clock. Gonna have some cookies. <laughs> oh, is that your bowl? Should I put this back? No. Okay. <laughs> anyway, we're going to the city tomorrow. Sort of. Uh, Queens is considered the city. Yeah, but when you say the city, it kind of implies like Manhattan. We're going to visit uh, her cousin, my niece. And the rest of the family tomorrow, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. which is going to be awesome. Yeah. We haven't seen them in a while. So it's going to be really nice. We're going to have a fun time. I don't think we can stay that long, though, because the weather's supposed the weather to be turning The weather's questionable bad. in the evening. So we have to get home early. But we will show you as much as we can, because we know you guys love it. <sighs> I'm, so t I'm so overwhelmed. I'm really tired, so I hope I get some good sleep tonight. I hope so too. Just crank up that sound machine. Yeah, yeah. Love it. Love it. Crank it up. It. Crank it up. 
All right, so we're gonna sign off because we gotta get stuff done. Gotta get clothes ready for tomorrow. Gotta get that stuff put away. I don't even know if I have room in the fridge for it. I doubt it. Yeah. <laughs> Guys, you're awesome. <laughs> We love you. Thank you so much for coming out. We really do appreciate you. Hope you're having a great week between Christmas and New Year's. Mark and I's uh, anniversary tomorrow is tomorrow. Oh my gosh. 33 years. We're not really celebrating them. Well, you are. Yeah, but we're going to get like something else later in the week or something. You know, to okay. eat. Something to eat. I Till next time, guys. Oh,